Rethink the unreachable. Take off and land anywhere, with no need for ports, roads, or runways. Rethink persistence. Five days airborne, three-ton mission payload, one powerful aircraft. Rethink sustainability. Low emissions today, working towards zero carbon flight tomorrow. Rethink capability. The low vibration platform for multi-mission systems. Rethink the journey. A new way to explore the world. A new way to explore the world. A new way to explore the world. And not everybody can be a robot polisher. Airlander. Rethink the skies. Rethink the skies. Airlander. Rethink the skies. Almost all of the photographs from the 1800s seem to have the sky purposely doctored to blur it out. Notice how you can never see any clouds, distant hills or land on the horizon, the sun even. And on some of them, you can even see the sloppy pixelated cuts around the buildings. There is a very curious anomaly when we watch the alleged footage of the Wright brothers' first flight in 1903. The spectators seem to be equally disinterested and unenamored. What if the skies were full of airships? Rethink the unreachable. Take off and land anywhere, with no need for ports, roads or runways. Rethink persistence. Five days airborne, three-ton mission payload, one powerful aircraft. Rethink sustainability. Low emissions today, working towards zero carbon flight tomorrow. Rethink capability. The low vibration platform for multi-mission systems. Rethink the journey. A new way to explore the world. Think Airlander, the powerful aircraft with a unique combination of capabilities. Airlander, rethink the skies. Rethink the skies. Airlander, rethink the skies. This amazing green, clean, quiet mode of travel was obviously not profitable to the oil barons and needed to go. Rethink sustainability. Low emissions today, working towards zero carbon flight tomorrow. Most of our train stations seem to have pointless high hangar shaped roofs and open halls. Unless in fact that's exactly what they were. Airship hangars and airports with connecting hubs to trains. And not everybody can be a robot polish shop. How would you eliminate your biggest competitors that can fly without the use of petroleum-based fuel? By scaring the shit out of everyone to ever set foot on one of these airships again. <laughs>